The Twins Hall of Fame was created in the year 2000, and since then, we have inducted 30 players, coaches, and off-field personnel who have contributed to the growth and success of the Minnesota Twins since 1961. Today, we have the pleasure of welcoming the 31st member of this illustrious group. But before we do, we're blessed to have 14 Twins Hall of Famers in attendance tonight. He had three consecutive 17-plus win seasons, pitcher Jim Perry with a career 980 fielding percentage. Shortstop, Greg Gagne. He struck out over 1,400 batters. Pitcher, Brad Redke. He was at the helm for both the 87 and 91 World Championship teams. TK, Tom Kelly. Hall of Famer, Burt Blyleven. Inducted in 2001, pitcher Jim Cott. Minnesota's own number 14. First baseman Kent Herbeck. No twin will ever wear number six again because there will never be another Tony Oliva, chairman of the Twins Hall of Fame, Rod Peru. So I went to Johan and said, Johan, Ken Griffey Jr. said, what was that pitch? He said, oh, Tori, that was the equalizer. In order for me to accept this honor, or when, whenever we're done, I would like to officially retire by catching, not throwing, but catching that last pitch. And I want my son to throw it to me. And every time I took that mound, I took my whole country in my back. I love you all. Believe it. The newest member of the Twins Hall of Fame. Now it's time to play baseball. Welcome hey. into the club, but Burke just did. It's It's got to make you feel really good to be Thank part you, of my man. twins Appreciate imm immortality it. did you have any anticipation I mean rule five did you when did you find out that hey I'm going to be with I have to be with that club the whole year or they're going to have to offer me back I didn't even know what rule five was yeah, right <laughs> you know uh, it's true and then they explained to me how the whole process works and, and, and I was like oh wow now I have a chance to to be in the big leagues and I remember when I, I came to the twins talking to my former my my scout I got the guy who who signed me, Andres Rayner, and then he was hoping that I didn't make the team so I can go back to to Houston. Whatever happens, you know, I'm happy here. I, I couldn't believe that I was at the major league uh, level with the Minnesota Twins, but I was having a great time. And these guys, you know, uh, uh, welcomed me uh, really nicely. And then, you know, the rest is history.